What do you think like the most uh rememberable lines were from this whole beef, bro? Like, all right, oh, this is this is gonna be good. Let's let's this is this is this is gonna be a good one. So, what do you think? Okay, was, my first memorable line. Uh, Metro, shut your whole ass up and make some drums, nigga. <laughs> that joint did hit. That was hard. Uh, drop it, give me fifty. Was cool. So we going song for song, like as many as we can name in the song. Yeah, like whatever, whatever stuck out to you. Like, what did what did you find yourself? What did you find yourself like saying the most, like randomly? Like for me, uh, it was like I, it was a lot of Kendrick lines. I was saying. <laughs> like, like, yeah, you 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 stuck on <laughs> not, not like us. Everybody stuck on not like us. Not, no, I was stuck on Euphoria for real. Like uh, Euphoria, I was like, yo, I still my kids be in the house saying what I'm saying because I'm just. That's how my daughters be. My daughters be the same way. <laughs> JoJo be like, draw, 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 draw. <laughs> <laughs> I go lie. We got this shit divided right now, bro. Yeah. I go lie. But uh for push-ups, Drake definitely hit fuck what is a king to a what's a king to what's a prince to a king? It's a son, nigga. That was hard. That whole that whole that whole what's the name? Because cause he said Prince outlive Mike Jack. Yeah. That's what Kendrick said. Yeah. And then Drake came back. He's like, fuck is this a 20 V1, nigga? What's a prince to a king? He a son, nigga. And then Kendrick came back with the I get more love in the city that you from, nigga. Metro shut your whole ass up and make some drums, drums, nigga. nigga. Yeah, Kendrick, when Kendrick came back with a it's a one V20 if I gotta smack niggas that he said it's a one V20 if I gotta smack niggas that are niggas 20 that v1. right with you. It's a, no, is this 20 V1? It's well, a one V20 if I gotta, if I gotta smack, smack niggas, niggas that, that right, right with, you. with you. I was like, dang! Cause it's it, cool. It, it's his tone. It's really like Kendrick really got me on the tone. It's like, if I gotta smack niggas that right with you. It's a, it's a, I, it's the arrogance, it's the confidence of how he's speaking with that nigga, like, bro. But then he came, but then Drake came right back, like, the same thing, like, he he dropped, because that's the same song. We don't want to hear you say nigga no, no more. more. Then Drake, Family Matters. Nigga, maybe, this song, <laughs> maybe this song you shouldn't say the word. Nigga, I said it. I know that you mad. I emptied a clip over friendly of jabs. You mentioned my son. Now deal with his dad. I gotta go bad. I gotta go bad. And then drop, 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 drop. Like it's it's a lot of quotables from both both parties, bro. Bro, like I ain't gonna lie. My favorite from Kendrick was um the Parkinson line. But then now I found Park out. His son. Then I found out Calico said that. That don't matter to me. Battle rapper. That don't matter to me. I'm sorry. It, that, that, How that don't matter, don't, though? It don't matter. There's no way we can prove that he didn't get that from Calico. I look at it like this, bro. He said that, and then 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 Geechee Gotti said the uh, YNW Melly line. That don't matter to me either. If you're like, credit, it's a battle. It's a battle. I, think I don't know what Drake said. If Drake said something that somebody, that somebody else, else nothing said, came out. Nothing came out that Drake said that somebody else said. Except the Twitter line. Those, I seen it. I seen the Twitter timeline. Drake definitely he he took stuff from the Twitter timeline. But like, may, you, maybe you talking about the hard part six, bro? No, I'm talking about Euphoria. His first response. Oh. Two battle rappers said to me that don't matter. I'm gonna tell you why that don't matter. That don't matter because yeah, you know that because you care about battle rap. The majority of people that's listening to this don't know who Calico is. Saying. I don't care about I don't care about the majority of people's opinion. Like they're gonna look at me like I'm crazy anyway. Because like I'm going Calico. I'm, I'm, Who's I'm, Calico, I'm, Calico, I'm talking bro? about I'm like fuck is a Calico. What is he talking about? That's why I'd be getting probably destroyed in your chat because it's just random Kendrick fans being Kendrick fans. They don't know nothing about nothing. They just <gasps> they like Kendrick Lamar. Crazy. <laughs> they like Kendrick Lamar and hate Drake. I don't I don't think that's true though. I don't think that's true. Cause that that's what you that's what you Drake fans don't understand. It's not that we hate Drake. It's that we acknowledge that Drake lost. That's it. We acknowledge that yo dope. Cause some people I feel From like what most, perspective? most people probably were more fans of Drake. Come on, man. Most coming into this battle, Kendrick won fans. He won no, fans. Because of this is what I'm telling you. What I say earlier. The nigga, it's a 20v1. It's Drake fans versus all of the other 20 niggas core fans. They fit, they, they, they artists not doing it. They, they artists can't do it. So what are they going to do next? They got to see Drake lose. They're going to Kendrick, no matter what he say. There you go. No matter how <laughs> it sound. 
It's a 1v25 guy smack niggas that right with you. Come on, bro. No, no I, matter I, how it sound, no matter what he say, <laughs> my artist couldn't get it done, so I'm going to go to Kendrick. We got to get this nigga Drake out of here somehow, some way. Bro, a line that stuck out to me was the when he was like, V12, it's a fast one. Bow, 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 last one. Headshots for the wit. Yeah, you better walk around like Daft Punk. You know what Daft Punk nah, is? Well, you, nah, you got to fix that. He said... My first one, like my last my one. My first one, like my last one. It's a classic. You don't have none. That's kind. You don't have one. But there's. I thought about that line. I'm like, what? Drake got mad classics. But right, if right. Kendrick is coming from the point of, nigga, you don't write. Do you have a classic? That's Kendrick why. I, did. That's, Kendrick, that's, what, that's why I gave him that. It's line. been exp it's been exposed that Kendrick has writers. Yeah, but not really. Now it's. Yeah, but every time, not, every time, bro, it's not like, really, it's not really what confirmed. Be, this is what I be saying, bro, like y'all niggas, when it come to Drake, it's just oh, it's so believable. It's like one nigga yeah, came out, there. one dude it's came out got, and said, "Yo, I've been writing for Kendrick." We Drake heard, is, we know Drake got writers before we Drake. Before niggas knew, it took one nigga. Yes or no? Before what? Before Drake was known or. Uh, accused of having ghostwriters, it took one nigga to say one thing, and then what? That shit stuck. It still stuck with him. But it was evidence. There was evidence of it. So Play we gotta find. We gotta find a reference. Play me we gotta find a reference track, track of somebody saying. We find a reference track of Kendrick, Kendrick Lamar right now. Then he's still in the same boat as Kendrick. I mean, he is he in the same boat as Drake. Yeah. Okay. Play me the reference track. Where Hello, where I, is his where is his uh. Up. Where's his dude? Just, all I gotta do is go to Kend I gotta go to I gotta go to Twitter and be like, yo, somebody find a Kendrick reference track. Somebody Where go find this shit. Track, bro? Where's the, the reference song, track? What is the song? I think the song is N95. Where is it at? We're gonna find it's gonna pop up eventually. That's and Drake said, nigga said Kendrick Kendrick music got a different bot when Baby King Baby King put his pen to it. I don't think he's just saying that, just say it. I think that's speculation. I think that's, that's Drake like speculating like you man King writing your stuff like I already heard like it's just speculation. I heard I heard Baby King I heard him rap like come on man I don't think he writing it. I think he might be inputting like yo Dr you should say this. You know what I'm saying? I that's feel like, the same thing as a reference track. No, that's not, no? That's not the same. No, it's reference not track same. is your every reference track that I've heard Drake has not said word for word. He said, okay, this sound good. I'll use this. And then I'll add my own shit here. Add my own shit here. I'll use that. I add my own shit here. It was never verbatim. No reference I've ever heard. When I pull up on a nigga, tell that nigga back back. He put his own words into that, bro. It don't matter. He used he that part. That. He said that word. I'm, well, that's like a, that's an input. That's not an input? No, bro. No. Because I felt like that was supposed to be him that said that. That's what I'm saying. Like, like no, bro. The Drake, Drake, Drake got writers, bro. This is come on, man. Just keep it a bean. Drake got writers. I'm not. I feel like his writers failed him during this whole battle. Like now is the time. I don't I think you, Drake uses. I don't think Drake uses writers, but in in when it's wartime, I don't think he uses the, writers. But that's where he went wrong. I don't think he uses writers. <laughs> that's where family he went matters. Wrong. There were no writer credits or nothing. I don't think he used writers. Y'all gonna back. stop with that writer credit crap, bro? That crap I don't, don't think, mean nothing. I don't think he uses writers, bro. I don't think Drake when it's wartime, actual hip hop battle rap. I don't think Drake uses writers. When he want to make a hit, of course, why not? I'm just I'm a hit maker. Let's let's work. Let's get this hit. But as far as when it's when it's battle time, I don't, I don't think so. Like I said, I would I would unfan Drake if I seen that. I don't think you would, because I feel like you'll find an excuse not to. Because they already said that he ain't right back to back. <laughs> you you, already, you just that? told me that early. You told me that early. You said daylight. No, they said they said daylight ghost right. That that's cap, bro. They just that. trying to dis discredit him, bro. <laughs> daylight from the West Coast. He's gonna make it look like whatever, bro. For the West Coast, bro. I don't believe that. I don't know. I know Nav has something to do with the beat. It's Nav fucking... has something to do with the beat, but Nav beat. don't rock with Drake. The beat, bro. You talking about a beat? Nav don't rock with Drake. He made he helped make the beat. Who the fuck cares about Nav? First of all, saying. second of all, you talking about a beat? I said write lyrics. Anybody could have helped with the beat. Nigga, Kanye could have helped with the beat. All I'm saying is, if I'm gonna get people to write for me, 
I'm definitely gonna get people writing for me when I'm I'm gonna be <laughs> like this is the no. time where I need my best writers. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, bro, that's I, a different. You're in a different. What? This is a different type of. This is a different stage. There's a stage. There's a hip hop stage where it's mainstream, but the battle rap scene is not mainstream. This is literally where you come to show off your pen. Let you let you know you're better than the next man. If you get if you get a ghostwriter to write some shit for you in a battle, bro, you can't get respected by any any real hip hop artist. I any respect, was... any respect that niggas didn't have for Drake, if they found out he was having a ghostwriter while battling anybody, it'd have been over. No, because the Drake fans would have just defended it. They would have no been like, way. "No, he didn't I, really have a ghostwriter." Me personally, is no way to defend that. It is. You a can't way. defend that, bro. Because if, no you're you're no if, you're if you're at war, bro. If you're at war, you have to do like you defend what you're defending is the hip hop crown. So for you to get a ghostwriter to diss another another man is insane to me. I would definitely disown Drake. As much as you don't want to believe it, I would disown Drake, bro.